Children deserve to live safe, healthy, and happy lives. And together, we can make that possible. But more than half of young people across the globe are dealing with physical, sexual, or emotional violence at home, at school, or in their neighborhoods. And the effects can be serious. Children who experience multiple forms of abuse or violence in childhood are much more likely to attempt suicide, experience, or enact violence. We all want this to stop. And the Violence Against Children and Youth Surveys are our best tools for gathering robust data on childhood violence globally. Because to solve this problem, we must understand it fully. The survey helps us understand what violence is happening, when it's happening, and where it's happening. Conducting surveys at the community level can shed light on who is most at risk so we can focus our prevention efforts. For example, Kenya used survey results to help them create and prioritize child protection laws, a national child helpline, and education programs to promote positive parenting practices. In just 10 years, these data-driven actions helped change the lives of Kenya's kids. They've decreased the rate of sexual violence against females by half, and sexual violence against males is down by two-thirds. This survey can help us address a top priority we all agree on, stopping violence against children and young people. Together, we can work to ensure everyone's right to a safe, healthy, and happy life. Learn more about CDC's Violence Against Children and Youth Survey and how we can use data to help eradicate violence so young people can live safe, healthy, and happy lives. Go to cdc.gov slash violenceagainstchildren today.